Hello, Pickle. All right, Dad, did you get your cheeseburger from Casey's? Yes, I did. All right, well, I'll tell you what, we got $1.4 million after your cheeseburger there, and that's what we're going to use to build our first farm. Yep. The farm is entirely yours to run, command, design, plan, everything. I'm here to help you do the work, and anything that's kind of farm sim weird, I'll be there to teach you about. All right, that sounds good to me. I got one point four oh. million dollars to spend. You have one point four million, but we need to buy land. We need to buy buildings, equipment. It's gonna go fast. So uh, why don't we drive around, find you a spot that you might like, and let's see what it'll cost. All right, I'll follow you. Okay, I don't know where we're going, but Th we'll, this truck, we'll. This truck here that I'm driving only cost me a hundred thousand. Well, yeah, you know, that, that, that's how they go. <laughs> I got to find you. All right, I see you. So I don't know if, do you want a farm that already exists or would you rather just buy land and then we build buildings as we go? Well, at my age, I'd just soon just buy one that farm already exists. So then we have a number of options around the map. I guess we'll drive around and see which ones. You, what kind of, uh, what kind of terrain do you want? I would like it gently rolling. Gently rolling. Okay. Yeah. I don't want flat ground. Flat ground holds water. Well, this stuff right here is just too flat. Yeah. Holds well, so you know, this map is actually based off of an area we know fairly well. Yeah. Uh, it's based off of the Madison County, Iowa area. Okay. So I thought it was the most appropriate place for us to start. Well, if you continue, if we can find our way west of where we're at right now. We're going to run into some rolling ground. Did you run that red light? I did not. No, it was it was uh, definitely green. All right. Because you know you get your ticket doing that. No, 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 no. Not when you know the cops aren't on duty. <laughs> in fact, I just had a guy run the red light right in front of me. Oh, see? It's commonplace. You know this pickup... Reminds me of the one I just bought that's just like your pickup that your mother stole from me. She did. So we'll give it back. Oh, we got a little river here or something, a creek bottom running alongside us. Now we're okay, getting so we, my kind of land here. We we can go check out this to the right. Do you want to check this out? Do you want to go straight a little more up that hill to the left? No, I, I want to see that rolling field up there further up the road. A little further up the road. Okay. You want to just lead and you drive to a place you like, and then I'll just follow you. Well, I don't want to get lost. Yeah, you, We're driving to nowhere. We're driving to whatever tickles your fancy. The only hey. way we're finding it is if you find it. <laughs> this place has got a barn. No, that's a covered no, bridge. That's Never a covered mind. bridge. Never mind. Let's drive up this driveway and see what's up here. All right. I know at one point in time there was a metal, like a one of those barns, metal barns converted into a house slash garage. Yeah. But it doesn't look like there's anything up here anymore. It looks like everything's going to be start from scratch. Well. This is kind of neat driving up here, though. It is. This is a neat little area. We'd have a view of a covered bridge right down there. <laughs> yes, we would. Well, they probably want a fortune for this because of that. <clears throat> yeah, well, you want me to see what the price is? Well... This almost looks like it's CRP in front of me. Yeah, it, well, maybe, maybe it's hunting land up here. All right, well, let me take a gander. All this right. chunk of land, they want they want six hundred and forty two, almost $643,000. Acres. Nine and a half acres. What are we going to do with nine and a half acres? <laughs> At 600 and whatever I said, yeah. It's pretty. I love the spot, but... Uh, we can't do it. It's pretty, but that's <laughs> just not financially feasible. We're we're looking for a farm, and this ain't even farmland yet. So, well, I, hate I to mean, say we it. could do I, hay, but I hate to say it, but uh, at that price, even if you're working a job in town, you better be making one hundred and fifty thousand dollars a year, mother and father, to pay the bills on that. Yeah. Well, we'll find a place that tickles your fancy and is within budget. This is the House Hunters of Farm Sim, and we're going to do it. <laughs> yeah. You know, I don't really particularly mind that flat ground over there. 
But what concerns yeah. me is one, the creek on the other side. Two, there's a covered bridge right there. That means there's water, and there's the yeah. water. And what happens in the rainy season? Right. True. That, that ground down there, I bet you anything, it's in a flood zone. Oh, yeah, I bet it is. I can understand tiling to a degree. I'm not 100% for tiling or too much of it. Hey, this is cool back in here. Well, if you find you a spot that you like, we can we can see what the price is. There don't even have to be a driveway. We can make a driveway. But, you know, just be on the lookout. Nah, we'll find out. Well, I'm kind of looking for established farm grounds. Right. Well, yeah, that's true. There's a driveway there. And I think we're yep. in an area where it's all going to be flood zone from the way it looks. I, you know, honestly, I would say we're in kind of sort of the rippy dumps of sorts, you know? Yeah, the rippy dump. That's that's about where we are. <laughs> and because we already have farm ground over there, we know all about the rippy dumps. <laughs> <laughs> we do. And we we know really do. That that's not very good ground. Nope. Here, we're not now the we're best. Getting, now we're getting up on top. And I would love to price this field right up here. All right. Well, let's pull up, take a look at it, and see what it costs. That's got to be a pretty good chunk of acres. I think there actually might be a former farmhouse up here to the right somewhere. Let's drive over there. But this chunk right in front of me is what you're interested in? Yeah. Okay. Well, at first, this sits on North River and Hogback Bridge. Let's see. That is... Four hundred and seventy-seven thousand dollars, and they have standby. That would include. Uh, it's about twenty-seven point nine, so about twenty-eight acres. Well, that's a <laughs> lot of money to give twenty-eight acres. Yeah, well, I don't think you're gonna find the acre countage is quite, you know, up there. I think it's gonna be a little lower than you anticipate the number to be. I tell you Just what. Just the way the game handles it. You say everything is for sale. Everything's for sale. Huh. Oh. A couple bins down there already in a house. Yeah, I see that. Old house, too. I know uh, if we do continue straight on this road, we should check this place out here if you want to. We should. But if we continue, yeah, we should. But if we continue straight, there will be another place we should check out as well. Hey, this place is uh, it's kind of cool. Let's go ahead and run the numbers on this. All right, let me see what I can do. I mean, it's not rolling ground, but it's sloping ground. Okay. That's good. Okay. So the piece of ground that includes this house is on the right-hand side of the road. The left-hand side is an additional piece that you'd have to purchase. The right-hand side is um, just over 31 acres. It's 31.28 acres. And uh, the price they're asking is $928,000. We, yep. can't, we can't buy this? The farm to the left? Yeah. We can buy the ground to the left, not including the house and, you know, the stuff on the right of the road. We can buy the ground to the left for $546,000. Uh, and It's uh, 30, 30 acres. 30 acres. Hmm. Where's that other place you wanted to show me? Just down the road to the right. We have to go back out on the main road. Yeah. Are you backing up? Uh huh. Hey, watch this. <laughs> Can't see where I'm going, but are you trying to use the mirrors? Yeah, I'm trying to, but I'm. When I look out, yeah. I uh... ah, I had it. Perfect. I don't know. I might drop back in the ditch. Nope. I'm <laughs> you got plenty of room. You're fine. Oh, hang on. I gotta. Reset my throttle. There. All right, let's go see that other place. All right. Are you sure this is not the Rippy Dumps? <laughs> More or less. Because what we're fixing to go up. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. That ain't as steep as the Rippy Dumps. Rippy Dumps are it's a not. lot steeper than that. They are. All right, so check out this place here to the left. I don't know what it'll cost, but we can find out. Ooh, Here's the main drive. Yeah, well, we can install fence on any place. We can replace fence. We can everything. We can do all of it. We can build a place from absolute scratch if you need to. If you want a piece of land only, whatever you want to do. But pull on in, check it out. I'll get the price. 
There's just deer just ran up in front of me again. Oh, my. <clears throat> Where'd you pull in at? This main drive. Did you pass me? Oh, yeah, you can pull in up there or come down here to the house. There's another drive. Oh, that's right. Either one works. So that driveway right up there where you were just sitting, yeah. right? Yep. That is the cutoff for the house being sold here. Does that make sense? The house is gotcha. separate from the farmland. So for the house area, for the farmland area, or for the farm area, they're asking $121,075. Wow. And it's, uh, land, though, is it? it's uh, 6.6 .6 acres on the house here. With the house. With the house, yeah. Everything that you see here, like the bins, the house, the gravel, that this area is that price. And then the land around we would buy extra so like you said one hundred five thousand. Uh, this property here is 121,075 dollars right now and that's with the house yeah the grain bins yeah yep fuel mm -hmm. tank. i can tell you that its value has gone up by 60.7 <laughs> percent 60.7 yeah that's yep so that's what it is sitting at right now Somebody's done a lot of work here. I like this place. Do you want it? I think for $121,000, Jake, we can't go wrong. A little bit of maintenance on All the right. house. We've already got bins. Mm -hmm. tank. Right. A nicely rocked. You just need roof. to put up some barns. But you got a, you got gravel flat pads here. Uh, the real thing is the land around. I guess, you know, we'll have to figure out farmland. What about this place once. just to the left with the with the barn so to purchase that piece it is included in that same chunk that i was talking about with the other house the other house owns that barn technically i guess yeah um so that was that nine hundred and twenty eight thousand dollar chunk of land I want to so we this. would be farming we'd be driving down the road a little bit to our farmland but yeah. that's not a bad thing I like this place, and for $121,000, I think it's a great investment. All right. <clears throat> Let's, Let's do it. it. You want me to? All right. We'll spend the money. Dad has approved the purchase. We're going to spend $121,075. We own it. $1.3 million is what we have to go now, but this is our house. This is our farm. Are you excited? I'm tickled. <laughs> me like too. Nice. I can't wait. All right. So I want you to start planning what we do next. I'm uh, I'm gonna check out this house and see what the inside might be like. You go. We got a two car garage, very nice there. All right, so we're gonna head up to the dealer, just across from where we bought our land. I'll meet you up there. Actually, you know, hold on, wait a minute. I'm I'll just ride with you. All right, jump in. What's All right, you got your blinker on. Huh? You got your blinker on. <laughs> I know it's bugging me. Is it off? Yeah. <laughs> well, are you in? Yes, I'm in. Oh, there you are. We can go. We can go. Hang on, hang on. Don't get in such a hurry. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I'm going to plug in the tunes. What are relax, we listening to? Relax. You want your heated seat or not? Huh? You want your heated seat? Sure. I like heated right. seats, even in the summertime. He well, yeah, honestly, they when, you, when your back muscles are all kind of tense from what you've been doing, it's kind of nice. Uh -huh. Yeah, I don't know why we were both driving around earlier. I could have just rode with you the whole time. Yeah, I was just looking at myself. My, uh, oh, my headset deal is not working correctly, but that's all right. Oh. I'll figure it out. Yeah, we got to look into that. I don't know why it's doing that. Oh, well, it's fun. You think you like farm sim so far? Sure. Sure. Well, oh. people can check it out on his channel, the Papa Pickle. Link in the description down below. Papa Pickle, now on farm sim. <laughs> Truck That's right. Sim. Is that what you call it? Oh, American truck sim. Yep. I love that they instead of Lorimer, it's just Torimer. Torimer. <laughs> Your blanker's on again. You, know, you don't trust me. <laughs> so I'm always taking a right. Big deal. <clears throat> My dad used to drive across the entire state of North Dakota, three hundred and some miles, with his left blinker on. Used to drive <laughs> me crazy. Yeah. And then when he'd, when he'd say it, he'd be like, I know, we're turning left right here. <laughs> <laughs> we're turning left in 300 miles. <laughs> That's our road to our house right there, ain't it? Yep, yep. 
but the shop is north here, just a little further. Mm. Next to the land we bought. I sure like the fireplace in that house. Oh, yeah. This is a nice house, actually. It's, it's going to be a nice place. I think we stole it for what we paid for it. Oh, for the price? It's a steal. Compared to the rest of the everything else we looked at? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, we got the bins. We had the fuel tank. We had... Yeah. And I've priced those stand-up bins, those portable ones they bring in and just stand up. Uh-huh. Them things ain't cheap. <clears throat> no. They're that's not. Our, that's our field, right? Yep, to the left. And then that place up there is the new equipment dealer. That's well, where we're I going. Just, if we can afford it, I'd feel better buying a new tractor and maybe yeah. some maybe some used equipment to pull behind it. I'm not afraid of. Well, I'll tell you what. We'll see what they got in here. And we're going to find you something, that's for sure. Tahitian Farm Store. Oh, well, that's easy. All right, <laughs> Tahitian Farm Store. Let's go out back and see what they got. There's an 8600 series in here for 54700 I know. Remember the 8600? <laughs> I do. <laughs> Ooh, here's a good one. Uh, 6155 for 120000 with all the mods. Oh, yeah. That'd well, be 172 horsepower. Do it does that, look like it has def. Yeah, it has def. Do you remember mm -hmm. that 60, what was it? It was a 6125? Yes. We went and looked at um, it. Yeah, I do. I do remember. We could have picked it up. Remember that? It was so light. Oh, I know. I know. Yeah, it was. I think this one here is a little bigger that you just looked at. but. Yeah. Nice tractors. Oh, yeah. There's some nice tractors in this list. We still have 700,000 in the bank, right? Seven hundred and seventy thousand dollars. Oh, I see now. Seven seventy one five forty. Yep. There's even an eight in uh, an eight thousand series, like an eighty one ten here. Where There's an eighty three ten. Where's the eighty one ten? If you go all the way uh, next to the white boss field, and yeah, oh, if you double that's click, nice. huh? Yep. So now you double clicked it. You can click and drag your mouse around. To yeah. Look around it. Okay. You can scroll to zoom in and out. Okay. Okay. So you can up the engine from the eighty one ten up to like the eighty three ten to get close to what we have. That's two hundred and twenty seven horsepower. Right. You know what though? That's a little bit too much horsepower for for what we need. Did you know that? Are you sure? No, if you if you if that's what you yeah okay. I mean, the, what do you on, want? I mean, on the farm, the eighty three hundred. Oh, well, yeah. That's too big for a lot of the things that I have to do, and that's why I have the 6715. Yeah. And this one here is not as, it's as big, but it's not as, <clears throat> doesn't have the horsepower. I like this tractor. Jake, I think yeah. this is a good tractor. Okay, so would you like it to be the 8110, 8210, 8310, or 8410? This is the 10. engine. 8110. Okay, so you want 180 horsepower. Mm -hmm. Wheel brand. Okay, so let's see. Do you want uh, do you want the duels in the back? Uh, no. Okay. Do you want them how they are now? Do you like how they are now, or do you want I anything do. changed? They spread the spread the weight well. Okay, so leave it. Yep, leave the tires. All right. Um, you want uh weights on the front? Uh, yeah, we better put weights on. Okay. Um, do you want the side indicators, those arms that stick out with the lights and the reflective tape? No, that's okay. We just... You want the front mud guard? Yes, I like those. Okay. Do you want the halogen lights or do you want LED lights? Hmm, what's better? Okay. This tractor goes 31 That's an extra $1,000. It is? Yeah. Go back to the halogen. Okay. All right. Um, let's see. Do you want the rear mud guard? It adds that kind of plastic, black plastic piece on the back, you know. How much does that cost? 300 bucks. Yep, put it on there. Uh, do you want it to be ready for GPS, or do you want GPS on it or anything like that? Can we do that later? Of course. I think we'll just wait. We, don't, we only have 39 okay. acres. Oh, yeah, absolutely. So, we've got an 8110 with uh, weights in the front, the wheels left as is, and we did go ahead and put the mudguard on there. 
Uh, no other changes. Is that everything? Yep. I like to keep it simple. All right. So you're looking at $81,550 for this tractor. Go ahead and buy it. That's all? $81,550. Is the engine going to blow up in it or something? No. <laughs> okay. Let's buy it. All right. <clears throat> so we're going to buy it. Yeah. I, I don't have permission to buy. Okay. Oh, cool. I like that tractor. All right. Well, go go check out your tractor. I'll drive your truck. All right. I'll get your truck. I gotta push. We need. Do we need to get something to put on the back of that yet, or? Well, let's look around. Hang on. Is my blinker on again? Yeah. What in the heck? (laughs) They don't turn off automatically. No, I obviously. Obviously, I gotta push E to get out of here. Yeah. Hello. All right. Did you say hello? Yeah, I'm standing right beside you. Oh. All down. right, so that is your tractor right over here, and this is your new disc harrow. Yeah. You all right? Well, I'm trying to figure out how to walk. Yeah. That's a nice machine, Jake. It is, it is. You want to get in your tractor and fire it up? Yeah, if I can get past this thing. And uh, we'll get you hooked up to your harrow, and what, pull this on home? You're going to have to step to your left. You're, you're, just, you're hitting your knee on it. I know. So, A. A or yeah. something. Yeah. Ah, forward march. W. Mm-hmm. And then E. Entry. Yep. I'm in the tractor. <clears throat> I got All right. It. So I got to start. Yep. Take a take a look at stuff. Get it started. There you go. You got it started. Oh, 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 oh. All right. So pull it on forward. And you're going to have to fight this pole here a little bit, but we'll All get right. you hooked up. Are you going to drive my truck home? Yeah, I'll take the truck home. I'll follow you, okay? All right, be careful. Yeah, yeah, you be careful. You're in the one in the slow vehicle. <laughs> okay. I just don't see that pole. Oh, You're good. I'll tell you if you hit it. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. <laughs> You're like, I could lay down and take a nap. You're so good. <laughs> Am I getting close? No, not really. You just keep it coming back. Do you see the icon yet? Uh, no. Okay, well, then keep coming back. We'll get there. I don't know who it is that had to put that pole right there. It's not a very good pole. That's yeah. for sure. I'd like to talk to them about that. <laughs> I think mainly the problem is is my my headgear is yeah, we'll not figure that out. very well. <clears throat> I have a brand new one. We'll just swap it out. Okay. Am I going to be able to hook up at this angle? Yeah, you're good now. You're good. Just keep it coming back. Bring your hitch to it. It'll. We'll be able to angle it over. You see the icon yet? Yeah. You should. All right. Yep. Press the icon, or press the the attach on the you know. Attached. Little trailer. attached. Yep. There you go. You're hooked up. I got you hooked up. Jacks up. Hydraulics are in. Okay. You can pull forward. I'm I'll follow you house. in the truck. All right. I'll put on the four ways and just run behind you here. All right. All right. So after all the the biggest purchases we've made so far, we're down to six hundred and fifty four thousand dollars. You think we're gonna have enough money to uh, continue getting what we need to get this year? I think we'll still have money left over to buy seed with. Well, I'm sure we will. What's your plan for planting in these uh, fields? What are you thinking? Corn. Corn. Although. Market's not really all that good on corn right now. Well, I guess we'll have to see what the market's looking like. Well, you know, rumor has it there's going to be a lot more bean acres out there than corn acres. Oh. <clears throat> and I do not follow trends. Like to do the opposite, huh? Yeah. I've been very successful doing that opposite of what everybody else is doing. <clears throat> Honestly, I think that is a good motto to live by sometimes. Des Moines. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> yep. Is there anybody behind me? No, you're good. It's I'm open. Gonna, I'm going to drive on the road. That's fine. I'll drive on the road with you. You let me know how fast that tractor goes, and I'll set my cruise. Right now, we're rolling 31 miles an hour. All right. Well, that's about what I'm going to set 33. it to. Dang. This is way better than the 8300. <laughs> this thing flies. Is this our, dry, our road up here? Uh, no, not quite no, yet. I don't think so. Looks Ours like, uh, 
Yeah, it looks like that's a development going in. Somebody got some pads down ready to build a house. Yeah. <clears throat> See that land we just bought, that's that's prime development too. Yeah, I know. Maybe someday that's what we can uh, either turn it into or sell it for. <laughs> yeah. that's we'll have I'm to thinking. keep an eye on the market because we do have a mod in here that makes the land prices fluctuate. So that's how we get that plus or minus percentage. Is so theoretically, uh, yes, up there is our turn. That's what I thought. So theoretically, we could watch the land prices, and if we see you know, the value of our land increase significantly, we could sell it if we wanted to. Oh, that's cool. But I think that's what we're going to be looking at. We're going to be watching them land prices. That's a good idea. Yeah, somebody, some developer comes out there and offers us way more than what we paid for it. Right. Yeah, we'll sell it. All right, here we are at the camp. Yeah, and you know what? Conveniently, home is not that far from the store or even the land. This is oh, going well. It's going real well. The only downside is that piece of land next to us right now, they want like 900 something thousand dollars for. <laughs> well, I don't know what across the road is worth. I guess we could check someday. Maybe they can just keep it. I know at some point, too, we're going to have to decide on some barns and sheds and stuff. Yep. I need, a, I need a machine shed. You do need a machine shed. But we still have money. Oh, yeah. Six hundred and some thousand dollars. We're sitting pretty so far. I'm just watching, looking at the machine here while I'm turning around. That's cool. Yeah. I'm excited. You know what I'm excited for is for you to be able to get on here and run this farm absolutely how you would want to run a farm. Just you get to control everything. And that's what I'm looking forward to in this series. So I don't have to hit the parking brake. <laughs> nope. You're good. You're parked. <laughs> I'm going to get out then. <laughs> All right. Well, you know what? It's uh, about 10 in the morning. Let's go inside, have a little early breakfast, and we'll get in the fields.